Okay, uh, this arrived today. Uh, the ATS twenty five X two receiver. Uh, this is a Wi Fi version, hence a small Wi Fi antenna on the back. I'm running it through um, uh, approximately ten meter long wire at the moment with a small adapter. It's a BNC on the back, so I've, I've BNC two SO two five nine. Um, I know it's coax long wire, but it, it goes into a Bayland, so that works quite well with my other receivers. Um, first of all, a couple of bugbears. Uh, the first one is this. You switch it on, and immediately you get this. Connecting to Wi-Fi, name your Wi-Fi net. Smart config. And you wait, and you wait. Uh, there's nothing that I can find on the menu for Wi-Fi and what the Wi-Fi actually does. Why it's even there. Uh, obviously you don't get any manuals with these. Um, it's a bit uh, suck it and see <laughs> to, to say the best. But um, yeah, we're still waiting. I uh, initially got this because I've got SDR receiver, which uh, SDR play, which runs off the, uh, the PC. Um, but I didn't want to be booting up the PC just to quickly listen to the radio. Um, but this isn't quick by any stretch. Um, oh, is it going to turn on? Oh, it's actually on. Right. <laughs> what was that? 30, 40 seconds? Uh, that's a quite a big bugbear for me. Um, it returns to the last frequency tuned to, which is quite handy. Uh, let's see if there's anything about... It kind of sounds okay. Good afternoon. Good evening. Delta Julia 9, Fox Bravo Alpha. The S meter, well, it just kind of sits at plus 20, plus 40, whatever you kind of do, so not great. Wasn't expecting that to be great. And that's the next bug bird. Did you hear that? When you tune up the band, it gets around about. 1920 kHz. Again. Again. It's... It's... Let's, let's try try another mode. Uh, where are we? And uh, short wave. It just jumps to fifteen megahertz. Don't know why. Uh, let's try. This was another thing. If you put in, I don't know, nine megahertz. Okay. So on 9 megahertz now and we're tuning up the band, it goes to 7. <laughs> you can tune down from 9 megahertz, but as soon as you hit 9 megahertz, we're, we're back on 7 megs, so not really sure what that's about, too. Um, I'll say I'm broadcast. AGC kind of works. Better than the previous models, apparently. Attenuator. Well, absolutely no difference whatsoever. <laughs> so what that's actually doing, I don't know. So, attenuator, no. <clears throat> I'll just turn the volume down a bit. Um, screen seems okay. Um, you've got a bandwidth switch. You can change the bandwidth. Quite a few selections on there. 
Uh, we're on four at the moment. Four kilos. Um, you can change the steps. It's got the hand bands. Going to next. Nothing about uh, Wi-Fi. Um, going to info. I don't know whether you can read any of that. We've got what the radio settings are, step sizes, EPROM size, blah de blah. Software version. Nothing about Wi Fi. Um, just tap the screen to get out of that. Um, so I really don't know why it's got Wi Fi and what it's got to do that boot up at the beginning. <coughs> doesn't seem to have any um, any facility at all let's try FM there's a switch on the back for FM Gorillas and that is Skinny A just formed at Coachella joined by oh it's just just changed <laughs> it's just changed now I don't know why it's done that I don't want squelch. Green curry with my partner Mark. Got the Greyhounds, Trouble and Greta in Barnsley. Loving the Everything But the Girl album. And we'll be playing it in the car heading from Woolworths. The RDS Can't wait to see you kind of works sometimes, there. sometimes it doesn't. Got a retro Tracy button, okay, which is like an old band. Everything But the Girl, Ben and Tracy are and here. And you can actually tune kind of a pointer the dial moves the pointer stays where it is uh, you can use the text number 88291 and also you can email joe.wiley but again I, I i can't see anywhere even if you go and set up fm start frequency digit backlight memo uh, retro language Fighters, Russian if you want it. Screen saver display, saver time, vertical screen. Not sure what these maximum scales are. I'll turn the beeper off. Bright display power, not really sure. See what that is. Low default and reset. Save to save changes yet? I don't quite know what that light display power was. <laughs> anyway, it's it's a bit suck it and see to to, to say the least. Um, it works. Um, And, and for its size and the fact that it's portable and it's got a battery in it and you can just stick it anywhere, it's it, it's not a bad bit of kit, but it's no communications receiver by any stretch. Um, if there's anything else you want me to try on it or you've got any ideas what this what the Wi-Fi is for, uh, please drop me a line. Uh, we'll go back into go to AM. There's no AM sync for some reason. It was on some of the sets, some of their software revisions. Now, I thought they brought it back with this one, but obviously not. But again, my biggest bugbear is this whole Wi Fi thing. What's it for? Um, it's connected to my, my uh, router now, I assume. Uh, maybe it's something to do with like go on my PC and find it and uh, access it to do some updates or something. I don't know, but that um, <clears throat> that long boot up waiting for the Wi-Fi to connect. I, I wish I could just switch that off because that's not good at all. Anyway, as I say, I've only had it five minutes. <laughs> um, we'll see how we get on. But um, any questions, uh, just drop me a drop me a message down below. Cheers. <laughs>